For starters, she kissed me. Oh, and Gina forgot to mention it, did she? It was nothing, my man, because I don't have any feelings for her. What? So you just smooched her face off for nothing? I just wanted to prove that everything she was saying was a lie. <laughs> don't give me that. You just wanted to prove she still had feelings for you. This is just one big ego boost. No. You're only happy if women are falling at your feet. I was playing her. Yeah, now you're playing me. And everyone's going to think you're still in love with her. I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry. I, I'm not in love with her, not one bit. But Anna was telling me how she'd changed and she was this really lovely person by letting Bobby back into her life and then Cindy was flaunting it in my face and I just, I just... I just wanted to test her. What, by snogging her face off? Look, it wasn't even a proper kiss. You know what? Why don't I test some people? I've still got my doubts about Jack Browning, Mitch, Rocky. Come on, do me a favour. Line them up, George. All right, it was stupid. I let her on, she leaned in for a kiss, I laughed in her face and sent her packing. And if Gina had hung around, she would have seen that. And do you know what? It felt good humiliating her like that. I'm sorry, but it did. She's put me and the girls for a whole world of pain. And it was worth it just for that moment to see her get a taste of her own medicine, to see that look on her face. Was it worth it? Yeah, yes it was. <sighs> but was it worth upsetting you? Upsetting Gina and Anna? Absolutely not. I love you, Lainey, and our family. And I hope you can find it in your heart to forgive me. It meant nothing. 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 Then I'm going to need you to prove it.